I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna eat you. No. Oh, hi. Me, Justin. And today I'm talking to you guys about Kamigami robots. So these little guys are super cool robots that you can build and then fight with each other. Uh, they're all made out of this flexible kind of plastic stuff with some cool, you know, innards and everything on the inside. Uh, but they have everything from light sensing technology built into them. Uh, they're Bluetooth enabled and they sync up with a really cool app on your phone. Uh, right now, it is available on both the iOS and Android system. The iOS is fully functional with like all the programming options in it. Android is supposed to be coming out in January. And this one looks like that one dude from Monsters Incorporated. So these things are all-terrain robots that can go over just about anything. I mean, sometimes they have to gain up a little speed before they can actually work. Uh, but they move anywhere from like super creepy slow all the way up to like five feet per second, which is pretty fast. They have multiple game modes. There's sumo, there's laser freeze tag, there's afraid of the dark, what is it? and then there's also just like a free drive mode. So eventually on um, the uh, Android version, but also in the iOS right now, these are programmable. So you can actually program them to do all sorts of different things like move three spaces, light up, eyes light up red, you know, all this kind of cool different stuff. The neat thing about these guys is that they're super easy to build and really, really intuitive to work with and everything right through the program. And they, like I said before, they look really like, like look at this guy, he looks freaking cool. So the build on these guys is that these are actually inspired, you can see by the leg structure and everything, by nature's fastest creature, insects. Now I know you're like, Justin, but I thought cheetahs were super fast and they're the fastest creature. They're not. Technically the fastest moving creature on the planet is the peregrine falcon because it can move its entire body like 250 miles per hour or something in a free dive or some crazy shit like that. Anyways, but if you look into the actual like body ratio to movement speed ratio, insects are kings of moving faster than anybody else on the planet. Technically. So that's what these Kamigami guys were based off of, you know, insects, because they know how to move. Oh, another little kind of because I'm 12 deep down and can't really get over it, you charge by their buttholes. Like that's where the USB charger thing is and the light sensor thing. It's all on their butts. So, pluk right in there. Who should buy this thing? Definitely educators that are looking to do. Um, you know, a fun build in their classroom, but also something that involves programming and, you know, it has a nice little fun yet educational thing. Parents who want to have like a cool build project with their kids, this is also really great for that. And anyone that just wants to battle stuff with each other, like if you, you want to just build these with your buddies and go to town on them, you totally can. You can have multiple robots running at the same time. Uh, there's all kinds of cool different modes. This is, this is a legitimate fun little guy to sit around and play with. I would definitely recommend getting this if you want to just build something and battle the shit out of it with your friends. I do. They're neat. They're fun to play with. Like we played with them around the office and we're kind of like, I don't know if we'd really like these. And then actually we started playing with them and they're like, okay, these things are awesome. So they all, you know, they all like battle and flip each other over and these things can even sense like when they're on their backs and stuff and that's like part of the game, which is really cool. Downside of these guys, like I said, half the features aren't available yet on the Android, but they're working on it. I actually talked with someone at the company and everything and asked them what was going on with it. Um, so they are going to be, you know, releasing more stuff for it. The other thing is that I kind of felt like Kamigami Big Brother almost when I turned this thing on. Like once I installed the app on my phone, I immediately started getting pop-ups. So it kind of just felt like I had, you know, the whole time I was using it, every so often this pop-up would just show up and it would be like, you still like my robots? It was just, it just felt kind of like, all right, leave me, you know, leave me alone. But I mean, that's kind of a minor thing. It literally, you know, one click on your screen and it's gone again. So that's not that big of a deal. If you want to pick these guys up, you can head over to KamigamiRobots.com to get some. We're actually doing a deal with them right now where you can get 30% off by putting the code CRITTV30, all one word, in at the checkout and everything like that to get 30% off these really cool guys. So that was Kamigami Robots. We'll post a link to their website right down and underneath the video here. Also, head over to our store where we have all kinds of cool new t-shirts for sale, all kinds of cool ASCII art and things like that. And we're just generating out all kinds of new t-shirts all the time. Head over, buy those, buy some music, buy us a beer, help us out. Don't forget to click the little bell icon on your subscription to make sure that you get notified when we put out cool new videos like this one. Ah.